everybody, my name's Chris, and welcome back to the next episode of The Legend of Zelda The Wind Waker HD, visually blind in hero mode. <laughs> in the last episode, we came into here with Medley after we found out she's the sage. Oh, sh oh, oh, where'd you even come from? Jeez. Oh no, I can't just talk to you. I'm picking you up. Hey, girl, this is very reminiscent, isn't it? Yeah. Alright. Okay, so we're told. I believe we found the girl with the sacred instruments. That if we play her the song, she'll be able to help us get into the temple. Actually, it's more like if she plays the song, it'll unlock this tablet or something. It'll open up the way for us. I don't really know what that means. Who's the Earth God's lyric? Whoa. Holy crap. Oh, I love that. Oh, man. When, there, when there's something about to explode, it goes whoop. And there's a pause, and then it goes boom. I love that so much. It's so cool. It's the Earth Temple. Oh, boy. Uh, a well? Oh, jeez. That looks dangerous. You can't just jump into You don't even know how far down that goes. Balls into the abyss. Ah, oh, I just punched my mic really hard. I apologize, you guys. Every time I go to adjust my glasses. Ah, I'm always so careful, too. I'm like, gotta make sure I don't... Gosh dang. Hit my mic. And every time I still hit my mic. Is there any magic in here I could really do with some magic? Hey, look, it's magic. And this is a weird start to a temple. There's grass down here. How often do you guys see grass in a temple? Hey, look, there's one single grass over here. Ah, oh, so like, there better be like 10 rupees in here. Ever since we hit that grass and... Um, uh, where the Deku tree is, what's that? The Forest Haven. I'm always like, oh, I wonder if I go to this random stray piece of grass. If, um, if I'll get, like, ten rupees off of it. But, no, it's never a thing. I wonder if there's ever, like, a piece of grass that will give you a lot of rupees. Alright. Are you gonna come, Medley? Uh, is she gonna follow me? No. Um... I saw we could press ZR to call her. But we can only do it when we're really close to her. So she's gotta come a little closer. <laughs> I'll wave my sword at her. Come on, Medley. What? Medley? What are you doing, girl? What you doing? Okay, so this is actually more or less an introduction of how Medley works for you guys watching. So you can pick her up and you can jump. Whee! And the only way... Oh, no. Is she going to follow... Is this actually hurt me? I feel like this should hurt me. Oh, crap. I don't want to jump off. Dang it. Wow. Three minutes in and we have done jack all. <laughs> oh, I really like that pattern. Oh, it looks so cool. With the giant skull and the thistle door. So, yeah. The only way for Medley to follow you through the doors, I think, is to walk through with her in your arms. Which I think is a bit silly, to be fair. Do we have a map? I mean, we don't have a map. But what's this look like? Oh, there's three floors. Kind of weird that I don't even know that. Oh, look, there's moblins, there's mooblands, mooblimlios. Let's. I guess we'll use. Well, I want a grappling hook, but I'm like, is there anything else I could use here? I guess not. All right, let's take care of these moblins for Miss Medley. <laughs> yeah, one thing you can do if you use a grappling hook against these guys. Holy crap! Three hits, really? Use your grappling hook on these guys. It um. Ooh, that's a lot of poopies. It it will cause them to drop their lanterns. It looks like I was wrong because I said the more powerful moblins, uh, the mo more powerful moblins, uh, will hold lanterns. But these guys only take three hits, so they can't be the more powerful one. Powerful ones, right? That can't be right. Hmm. All right. Uh, what else do we got in here? Oh, look at that! It looks so freaking cool. I love it. Fan diddly tastic. And see, oh, see, this is a blue one. The other ones are brown. Let's see how many hits these guys take. Just as many. Interesting. Kind of weird to be fair, but uh, okay, I'm not judging except for the fact that I just totally just uh, did judge. <laughs> hmm, those things don't despawn as quick as they did the original game. I think I did see that as well. That's it? Everyone's dead already? Holy crap. That was more than three. Um, I noticed, or actually, I, I, when I looked up the differences between this game and the older game, well, Link, I'm not very confident, but I think you should try to fly. I'll, I'll fly when, where you tell me to. Just tap A to keep me airborne. Okay, whenever you're ready, just use the Wind Waker, Wind Waker to guide me. Interesting. 
I didn't even know she told you that. And also, this is totally... This staff is totally glitching through the stairs with a halberd, I guess. Alrighty, uh... Well, actually, I guess this show... That, that door is locked over there. Oh, it's so cool with the size and the broken skull. Ah, and it does not look like you can make this at all. Oh, no, no. Okay, phew. <laughs> And also, I haven't made mention of this yet, but take a look at these switches. What is, what's this pattern on them? Oh wait, no, I did talk about this, I think. Well, Link, I'm never- Yeah, you, you said that already. Alright, I'm gonna put her down. No, Medley. I need you to- Well, whatever, just throw her. Whee! <laughs> she doesn't make it. There's two switches on these, which I'm pretty dang sure- no, that is not what I was trying to want to play at all. I was trying to play the the Gale, the Ballad of Gales. But no, if you play the command melody, and yeah, this is really weird. I don't remember if they directly tell you this or not. Um, I, this is a new recording session, so if the uh, King of Word Lions told us we could do that, then yeah. I, I see we have a blue magic meter, and that's pretty much your flight meter. If that runs out, then you can't fly. <laughs> you run out of flying ability. Yay! And yeah, make sure you get Medley over to this door. Oh, it's so cool playing as someone. I love it when you play as someone different that you normally don't do in games. I find it really fun. Especially when it's just like rare and you don't do it for very long. Oh, I was totally hoping I'd land that fire because I wanted to see if it would light me on fire or not. I mean, it probably would have, but. <laughs> Ooh, hey, look at shoes. Whoa! What the heck? That's kind of weird. And. It's kind of honestly kind of strange that they expect you to figure that out. So let's face it, that's kind of weird. <laughs> there we go, I wanted that. Yeah, I'll kill ya. I'll kill ya! Oh, I just noticed you could totally kill the green shoes with, uh, oh! With one hit with the Master Sword now. They used to take two hits. Oh, there's another red shoes. Get out of here. Get out of here! Yeah, take your red shoe. Alright. Now these are black shoes, I guess. Whoa, what? How the heck? I'm trying to... There we go. <laughs> I still get mixed between these. Seriously, what about... What about... Uh... There's nothing you can do to kill these guys, you guys, guys. Well, there's actually one thing. <laughs> um... Should we just... I guess we'll just straight up take command of Medley. That would probably be best here. Oh boy, are they still trying to attack me? They totally are. Yeah, if you shine light on them! But you could take out your thing by pressing A. Alright, we're gonna quickly do this. And then you could either toss them. Or you could use your skull hammer, which I kind of prefer to do because it takes less actions. Oh yeah, we never did deliver that mail, did we? Bam! And it's freaking amazing. Bam! Yeah! And you'll notice here this like liquid esque chest. It's really weird. Oh, you know what though? Oops. Um, when you see tapestries like this, you can actually burn them. Yay! And I don't know if these are gonna reveal anything. I didn't even know these were in this room. <laughs> Let's see here. Uh, if there's anything interesting on them, I bet I could get Medley to fly up in them. Haha, <laughs> joy pendant. Yeah, right. Well. Does make me kind of want to get them. Okay, uh, so the doors are revealed. However, there's this liquid-esque chest here. Why don't you stand in the middle here? That might be cool. Let's see what happens. What happened? I went like this. Oh my good lord! Holy crap! I am transmuted into another dimension. Oh yeah. Probably doesn't play the song again. So yeah, you can take it out and you can direct which way you point it. And if you shine on these weird statues, which is a bit obscure. I mean, I don't know. I find it kind of weird. Oh, it took a heart of damage, I just noticed that. Yeah, I find that really obscure, but, you know. Wait, is there not? Huh? Oh, I can't pick it up as medley. Interesting. That's kind of weird, actually, but okay. Uh, what, what about if you did this? Actually, I thought that's how you reveal this chest, but apparently I'm wrong. Oh, it's shining. Aha! It is! Now let's see what happens here. Oh my god! I'm raising up! <laughs> that's great. So, could we collect... These and whatever the A pops up for me to use my um can I not? What? Oh, I probably gotta use my boomerang. Alright. <laughs> That's so weird. So yeah, 
I guess I gotta use my grappling hook or boomerang. Probably my boomerang, actually. Definitely my boomerang. You got the dungeon map. You can view it by pressing the tap screen and see the rooms I haven't even been to yet. All right, let's take a look. All right. Yeah, th three floors on the first floor here. Basement hole. These all look pretty big. Minus the basement, too. A bad circular room on the south. There's totally gonna be the boss room, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, it's the farthest away from where we are right now. And it's a big circular arena type room. Let's face it. It's probably what it's gonna be. And that's. I don't actually know that. But I'm just kind of guessing. And you know me and my guesses. And I, I don't know what that particularly means. Aww. Alright, let's get a better angle here. There we go. We got a joy pendant. I'm just. Well, I'll just, well, actually, we probably don't have enough joy pendants in this game. Let's take a look. Uh, we still need another 10. Holy crap, that's quite a bit. It's a lot more than I thought it would be. I, I thought I wouldn't even need to use my... Um... Oh, is there another tapestry? There is. Well, crap, now I want to see what's in that one. I'm sorry I'm taking forever on this first room. Or, second, or third room, actually. See, not so bad now, is it? Is there anything there? I said that really weird. I said that with like a weird Scottish accent. <laughs> Whoa, what the heck is this? Well then, that's very mysterious. Uh, first off, is there any bad guys in here? I forgot about... Well, I didn't forget about this room. I, I was going to say, this room is actually like the most reminiscent. I just forgot that this room came so soon. I think was what I originally was going to say there, but then I forgot. <laughs> okay, let's do this, question mark. Whoa, we could even push this weird fog away. Uh... Is there anything to become of this? Whoa! Let's do the other one. What? It leaves? Hey, there's a switch over there. Oh man, this is weird. I feel like there's, these should be reverse controls, but they're not. Oh no, what? Okay. When you, whenever you step into this weird fog, it does some kind of weird curse effect on you. That you can't use any of your items till you, you've been out of it for a little while. Okay, there we go. So yeah, let's hit the switch. We'll activate that room, apparently. Is there another one? I don't think there's... That's weird, it's activating with me still. There, I don't think there's another one. Yeah, can't use my item. Like, I'm pressing the button to swing my hammer. It's not working. Can't take out my sword. Can I defend? I can't defend. I can only crouch. Oh, this is a locked door. Alright. Medley, let's go. Hey, there's a little prison looking thing up there okay well I guess this is the wrong lock I thought it was the other one that was locked but clearly not because you know it's locked and stuff hey look there's tombstones <laughs> freaking bubbles <laughs> I just find it funny like I'm just gonna put just a skull in here wow I'm kinda happy that worked out I did not think I was gonna hit him I thought for sure he was gonna hit me there but nope BAM pretty nice being able to kill these guys in one hit yay overpowered master sword Alright, Medley, let's move forward in the room. I'm always a little bit worried because Medley can be attacked and it can be terrible, terrible times. So you just want to kind of be careful. What's this do? I bet that unlocks that door, doesn't it? It totally does. Um, well, let's find out what this is. I see a treasure chest over there. I'm assuming you could shine light onto. Shine light like a diamonds. Ooh, what's this? I pull it back, moving closer just to get it away. I don't know what that means. Oh, look, it's lights. Let there be lights. Uh, okay, Medley. Let's see what you can do here. I really like how they, the addition of this game. I hope you guys know what I mean when I'm saying, like, when you play The Wind Waker, a song you've already played, like, it doesn't replay it. D does that make sense to you guys? <laughs> it might not. Alright, oh boy. Just one of those chests. Ooh, although that might be a key, to be fair. Alright, might as well do that while we're playing as medley here so I don't have to worry about it. And then we'll go open this. Well, this will either be a key or a stupid joy pendant. You got a small keys that open up locked doors. You can always in this dungeon. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, wowzers. There's a floor master. Oh, yeah, we did see one of these in the Forsaken Fortress, didn't we? Hello? Oh, what? How come? I was trying to figure out why the heck it wasn't working. Normally, that hand's supposed to come out, and they're not supposed to just pull you out like this. Oh, good lord. Well, that's okay. Just put it over here. Oh, and it, didn't, it didn't even do damage to me. And Medley's back. Oh, no. 
Well, alright, I just... I'm just riding. <laughs> Screw all the things. We already fought you all. You, we already fought y'all. Oh no, the bubble's gonna come get me. The bubbles are gonna eat me alive. Alright, let's go. Oh. Um. Well, this is a bit of a pickle. <laughs> a bit of a pickle. Because Medley actually cannot come in these rooms without me. Like, she can't open doors. So we can't do anything in this room for now. And there's a master hand. Or master hand. Hello? You, sir. You, sir. I should pretty think. So there we go. So the best way to deal with these, I notice, and these are actually kind of scary to fight, is do that and smash their faces in with a freaking hammer. Great. Fantastic. It actually worked. I'm kind of shocked. Okay, there we go. Go get Medley. We got our key. Let's get out of here. Medley, let's get out of here. You know what I'm saying, dog? Yeah, you know what I'm saying, dog. I don't know why I'm talking like that. I apologize. <laughs> right, let's open this door. Ooh, this room, right? Actually, oh no. Okay, I was gonna say, I hope there's no wall masters. Because actually, since it might not even happen here, because I might get lucky, wall masters could actually pick up Medley and pull her in and transport her to another room. Yeah, it's kind of annoying. I'm kind of, I kind of thought it was scripted to happen there, but apparently not. All right, let's take out our. Oh, there's, apparently there's another one coming. Oh crap! Don't attack me, asshole! Uh, oh, get out of here! Jeez! <laughs> you guys like my Boston accent? Out there, get out of here! Okay. Jeez, come on, you guys! Ah, Fudgios! Dang it! Stop it! I got stuck on the ledge there. Get up, you know what? As you guys know, if they step in the light, they turn to rock. So we're gonna put them in there. Say, don't you put it in your mouth. However, you'll see there's two switches. I think there might have only been one in the original game. So let's put these guys on here. Oh, are these switches in the lights? Oh, that's awesome. So theoretically, they should just freeze whenever they try to turn back, right? There's another one! There's more! Come on, Medley, let's get out of here. Let's freaking bust this lemonade stand. <laughs> so stupid. Yeah, I actually really like these switches here. I actually kind of hope that. Yeah, see, they turn back. That's so cool. Oh! Oh, no, no, that just activates the stairs. Wait, what activates this then? Maybe one switch activates the door and the other one activates the stairs? Question mark? All right. Okay, th these guys are scary. These guys are very scary. Does that kill them? Oh no, it doesn't. Ah. Yeah, like you, like you guys know, if they grab you long enough, they'll pull you in. And it's terrifying. I don't like it. I hate it. I hate it, man. Uh, what do we got here? Do we, do we don't have any lights. Is, there, is that a switch? It might be a switch. Oh, I think it is actually. What else would it be, right? I mean, it's weird. It's not even a switch. It's like a little platform. But okay. <laughs> There's no indication that it's a switch to me, but if you say so, game. All right, let's pick her up. Hey, <laughs> girl, you know what I mean. Stop it! I just want to put you down. Actually, I guess there wasn't even a point. I might as well just play the melody. The command melody. Yay. Oh, no! I wanted to press A. Okay, seriously, you press A to fly, and you also press A to use your harp. <laughs> it's like they couldn't use another button. You have like two buttons as medley, that's it. Alright, now yeah, if you see these symbols on the walls, you can also blow them up, interestingly enough. And really, another pot already? I feel like I'm a bit soon, but alright, if you say so, game. Oh no! I guess the whole gimmick is you can only press A and the light, so you should be able to use the same button for flying as you can for um, using your reflective surface, but still, that's a bit weird. I mean, they have a million different buttons on these controllers. Seriously, come on! <clears throat> There we go. Alright, it could be a bit finicky sometimes. Medley doesn't have a very long range of being able to use those, apparently. What's... Is this a switch as well? Oh, I guess maybe that opens the door. Oh, no, it makes a treasure chest appear. Interesting. Ooh, I think I know what's in that one, you guys. I think I do. Do you want to know? Huh? Do you want to know? So is this just straight up activate? I guess it is. Huh. <clears throat> 
It's weird. You think you could still like, get access to that? You just can't like you know get out of the room. <clears throat> Jeez, what is it, all scratchy there? I need I need some mates too. Oh, oh, you know what? I should have freaking got Medley to fly up there when I was controlling her. Dang it. Well, I guess I could just use up my time more. <laughs> I mean. Wait, hold on. Actually, I might be able to do this without taking control. I just freaking hate it. I, uh, this is what I was talking about earlier in the game, where you're gonna hate the command melody because you use it a million times in this dungeon. Oh, good lord. Okay, that's okay. That's weird that those give me fairies, but alrighty then. Ooh, what's this gonna be? There's a cutscene, so you know it must be important. You got the compass. Now you can see where things are hidden in the dungeon. Use the map screen and see for yourself. Yes. Link, do not worry about straying away from Medley in the depths of this temple. Just relax and open up your dungeon map. It will show you where Medley's location is as well, so you can easily confirm her whereabouts. Okay. Well, you can't really see because my face is, my stupid face is in the way. <laughs> but you can see Medley's there. And yeah, you could see that we also missed a treasure chest. And hey, look, I was wrong. I thought the temple boss would be on the, where the B1 is. But no. Interesting. So yeah, three treasure chests down there and four down there. There's a lot of treasure chests in this dungeon. And yeah, apparently we missed one. Well, not really, but I mean, we walked in the area it was. Okay, I'm gonna call an episode here, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. My name's Chris. What the heck is that thing? Is that a g g g g g g ghost? There's two ghosts. The next one? Oh no! Ah! <coughs> Can't touch this asshole. Is he coming for me? Oh no, he gave up. <laughs> like, oh, he, he must have combusted in the fire. The next one. <laughs> we'll continue the temple and see all the interesting things Medley has to see through her pretty little eyes. So adorable. Bye.